Hey guys, Dave Fender here again, playing good ol' Amnesia the Dark Descent. Now, uh, we just got through, uh, the sewer water area full of shit and bullshit. Uh, so we're now in a, what I came to assume be some kind of dungeon torture area? I don't know. Chains are rattling. Okay, so I don't need that just yet, because I am full on oil, but yet I do not have any jars of oil yet, so I will... Leave those there. There's a note. August 1839. I can't stop sweating and shaking. The warden ritual was not something of a sane mind. I did not even realize the dungeon was still in use. Alexander had his servants bring one of the prisoners, a murderer, he told me. Alexander made all the arrangements, but he said I had to perform the ritual in order to have the right effect. The shadow could be led astray by the blood of another. Killing the man would provide us precious time. What else could I do? Alexander said it had to be done. He is saving my life. I don't have the luxury of argument. Okay, so Alexander had Daniel murder a murderer so that the shadow that's chasing me would go away. Not working, there must be something wrong with the machinery. Two levers on the top floor are not working. It is probably some problem with the machinery. Okay, so Daniel said that he that this is the dungeon and it's still in use. So Alexander has been kidnapping people. Also, there's blood on the floor. Wonderful, you know. That's a wonderful decor of a dungeon. I'll just have lots of blood everywhere. So that does confirm that this is a dungeon. And Alexander has people held here. Wonderful. He probably held me here too. Oh, this looks lovely. Let's... Actually, before I go down there, I want to check the other uh, rooms real quick. Uh, just, to, just to see what they are. Because, you know, um, that does lead down, but we don't know where the other ones go. So, like this one. Oh, this one has a bunch of rocks, but it has a tender box. So that's good. Okay, got another tender box I just used... So yeah, there's two monsters in here. It won't budge. Okay. So that one won't budge. I might try to throw something at it, because there was rocks in that room. Maybe I can pick one of those up in another tinder box. Yeah, let's see if I can just... There! Yeah! Okay, so that didn't work. So yeah, we do have to go down, of course, you know. Just got... I just went up, and now we're going back down. Eh, whatever. As long as I get out of here and, you know, get the shadow off my back, and then we're fine. I'll do basically anything. I killed the man! Now I'm going downstairs to find Alexander and in this. Okay, is there something under the stairs? I feel like there may be something under the stairs. Let's see. Oh, tinder boxes. There's that. And a crate. Oh, there's nothing like under the stairs other than the two tinder boxes. I got a feeling that uh that no face the no face my oh, okay. Agrippa, I need you to stay awake. Can you feel the syringe? No. I can't feel anything. Alexander? Yes. Soon. I won't even be able to move, will I? Your life is safe. I don't doubt that. But will it be worth living? Okay, so Alexander has some guy named Agrippa down here, or experimented on him at some point. Laboratorium. The laboratory. It won't budge. I wonder why. Maybe do I need a crowbar? Maybe a hammer? Take that! Ah! That's not what I need. Okay, a shovel? Well, that may work. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just take this in case, you know. Oh. Hello there. Are you Mr. Agrippa? I don't know if you're still- don't mind the shovel, I brought it just in case. Oh! Help me. Oh, his body. Please. Okay. Thank you. You have my gratitude. My name is Agrippa. Who would you be? My name's Daniel. Like the prophet thrown into the lion's den? <laughs> Tell him, are you among the lion's den? 
Maybe? If I could stop Alexander? Yeah. Oh my. So Babylon shall call you, say. <laughs> you hurry too much. Alexander is toothless without an all. Yes. That's that's not very promising. Oh. The sector is basically a penetrant, but I guess my own. It could be breached by an author. But Alexander broke his, I mean, my own, a long time ago. Really? Then if you tell the truth, by all means, seek out the pieces of the broken wall and mend the way. I believe he uses them for torture now. They practically leak matter, which is quite useful, I understand. There should be six of them. Look around the choir and the transept. You should be able to find them there. Jeez, poor guy. The orb is needed to enter the inner sanctum. Its shattered pieces lie scattered in the torture rooms. Of course, I mean, hey, why not? That's where I'd keep all my pieces of orb, just in my torture rooms. I hate to bother you, Fuzzle, but if you're really going after Alexander, would you consider taking me with you? I know it sounds ridiculous. I mean, look at him. But if you find anything concerning a man named Johan Weim, would you please bring it to me? Johan Weim. I believe he was working on a way to help him. A recipe for some sort of potion. A tonic to free me from this husk of mine. Okay. A grip of the dying man seeks a note written by a man named John Weiner. Or Weiner. So I will definitely get that for him, because poor guy, he's been, I don't know how long he's been hanging there. Just hang in there, bud. I'll, I'll, I'll get you. Don't worry. Alright. So I guess we're going in the dungeon. We're going in the torture rooms. Why did Alexander need to torture people, though? Is he just a, that much of a madman, or what? Ah, okay. Get back to smacking myself in the door. At least that's just a cell. That's not hitting itself in the face with the door. This room has some blood in it. Let's see what's behind door number three. Is it blood and despair? Maybe. No, just shackles. Never know what might be in here. Okay. Oh, uh, I had second opinions on that door. I didn't know if I wanted to open it. I'm gonna open one of these. There's just gonna be a monster in there. Should be like, hey, how you doing? That one has blood and despair and a tinderbox. Here in the whales of the damned. Wonderful. Okay, so there's a second story. And I'm assuming this door is locked. Okay, so that's the chance. Very nice looking. Very interesting looking decor, I won't lie. Okay. Oh, a nice piece of meat. I picked up meat. Don't know why, and a moldy piece of bread. You know, in case I get hungry, I got a little piece of meat with me, you know. You never know when you're gonna you're gonna work up hunger, you know, walking around. Okay. I know this. I've been here already. I know this taste. The taste of the Damascus rose obfuscated the truth in the dim hair. They may sweep the traces from my memory, but my body remembers. These are cut speak volumes. Even though my mind remains silent, they will be back. Uh, they will be back. God, my jeez, Louise! Whatever Alexander was doing here, oof, it's not good by any means. Another ten bucks. Don't mind if I do. Is that a spirit? Oh, jeez. Ugh, everything about this is just unsettling. I don't like it. My thoughts exactly, man. Just gonna go. 
It had gone too far. The man was suffocating as he no longer uh, breathed per uh, properly between the lashes. Please started to look for the Damascus Rose Oil. Oh, Damascus Rose Oil is... God, man, I gotta, gotta help that guy. Okay, so John... John Mayer. Looks like I'm seeing red again. Really? You're bringing in another monster. Woo! Look at this place. Got the blue torches and everything. Oh, we got a dude. We got a derp face, and he is, uh... He's hunting. He's on the prowl. Okay. Just a little further. It's like Orpheus descending into the underworld. Are you hiding something? What do you mean? Never mind. Your intuition is remarkable. I'm not sure I'm following. It doesn't matter. It's just a myth after all. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh god. Go, 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 go. Shut the door. Barricade the door. Okay, there we go. That one box will protect me. I trust that box with my life. Okay, so what do we have here? 12th of August, 1839. Banishment ritual is taking longer than expected, and we have to do what is needed. I spend my time helping out the prisoners. Being around these degenerates makes me ill. None of them even tries to face their punishment with any kind of dignity. They taunt me with their lies of innocence and their cowardly pleas of mercy. What can make a man fall so far from the grace of a civilized existence? They are all wicked men, and I remind myself of it constantly. Still, I am thankful for God sending these monsters our way as they will serve as the instruments of my salvation. I try to study the different tools in the torture chamber and learn how to use them effectively. Last time was messy, and the effect suffered from my inexperience. When the next warding is to be performed, I shall be ready. Okay. So I may have killed even more people. A bucket of tar. Why do I need the bucket of tar? Eh, I want the tar box, thank you. Oh, look at this little box. Well, that'd make more noise. I want to make sure that guy knows that I'm here. You know, I don't want to make this too easy. Oh my god, this noise in here. So, much. so I have some meat and some tar. And of course, my wooden crank. Solid metal is in good shape. It is. It's no use. It's no use! Okay. I might have to come back and do this later. Alright, well, I better go back out and see what, what's his face. Okay, he appears to be guarding one way. But that way over to the left is clear. Unless he, the monsters disappeared, in which case that's really good for me. So we'll go over here and see what's over here. God, just look at this place. Jeez Louise. Ugh. What is going on in here? I see some weird blue lights. Purple lights. Whoa! Okay, so I think that leads to Alexander, because it said about the orbs needing to be... Yeah, okay, so this is where I need to go. For when I get the orb. Uh, let's see, the pedestal on, in the cha the chancel has a depression in it and that could fit an orb, okay. So that's where I'll need to place the orb at whenever, when, of course, when I get, if I had one, that's where I'd put it. Okay, so, I need to find the note for, me, for uh, Agrippa, my good old friend. Uh, I need to find the orb, Agrippa, and then, this guy still in there? And then there was the two there was the two levers that were working in the other room. Or weren't working you know, always. Oh god, I saw that statue over there. I'm like, ah Freaked me out, okay. So I'm just gonna shut the door in case that monster comes back. 
Okay, all is lost. I must once again start over. Ever since I recovered the, the orb first found by Agrippa, I have depended on it for my research. The incident with Wilhelm made me most impetuous. Fearing a paucity of prisoners, I proceed with the final ritual without proper foresight. The orb crack and fell, cracked and fell into six parts. I have tried everything, but yet, uh, I, yeah, if I could just talk, these least, but have yet to mend the thing. Unless I can think of a way to piece it together, I will have to find another. There is still life in the pieces, and even if the orb isn't restored, I might be able to salvage some of its power for some other purpose. Centuries have passed in vain, and I begin to wonder if they ever will be able to see my love again. How much longer can I sustain my life? Okay, so that was probably a note from Alexander. Hello, Mr. Suit of Armor. Okay, what the fuck is up with this room? Oh, look at this. Lovely little statues. Alright. Some weird demon altar. I'll use that in case I need to summon some demons to fight the other monsters. Okay, um... Well, this is a thing. I wonder if I can use an item on this. Use the meat! No, huh? Well, I tried. Okay, so that, that was just a note. So, I definitely need to do something with that door. I have the hot tar. Could I potentially melt the door? I don't know. So, does the door that won't budge? Or would the tar help? Is this still time for the sick tank? If so, blame yourself. You started this. You sent me that letter asking for help, and this is how you repay me. How dare you! Fuck you, man! You made me kill people! Which probably wasn't even necessary. See what, Alexander? Go fuck yourself. I guess we'll just. Okay, can't use that. Hand crank! Hand crank will always save me, though. So, I guess I'm gonna go back and see about the other room. So, I'm gonna pause it here, and if, uh, if it does work, then I'll show it, but if it doesn't, then I'll, I'll just be back and say, uh, what happened or not. So, alright. Oh. These cells are meant to be prisoners who are under treatment. The people you send for will end up here. Remember that the confinement itself works as a preamble to the torture, and you should pace yourself. Don't take anyone before they are ready. Understood. Sounds from the torture chambers are shuttled in through those pipes in the ceiling. Manage your victims well, and let one prisoner's pain instill terror in his cellmate. I have two gates here that I didn't mess with before. Heavy doors blocking the path. Well, there's two heavy doors. Thank you very much, Mr. Mr. Daniel. Okay, well, there's my pal Agrippa. But lover? Oh, that So many of Alexander's things are breaking down. Look around. Maybe the other room. There are machine parts in oh. this place. You'll find a way to fix it. It's so weird how like cheery he is. He's like he's just like, oh you know, it's probably around here somewhere. I'm glad that I have this guy. Okay, so there's that room, the laboratory. But then the levers need fixed though. So that barrel's not gonna be helping anytime soon. So it says it he it needs to be fixed though. I don't know if you met in the other room as in that room, or because I don't remember seeing anything in that room. Okay, Daniel, I know stair technology is quite advanced, but geez, man, come on. They're easy to climb up. Okay, let me stop wasting oil. Okay, so the lever room was this one? No, that was the rock room. Ah, that one won't budge. This one. How about the one that's freaking open? Work. How am I doing on oil? I'll better restock. A little amount of oil. Okay. So, I need to fix the machinery, but th the door won't open. God damn it. We have hard oak. Okay, oh, that was. 
That was cool. I just kind of slid down the banister there. Okay. Definitely need something to get into the laboratory. But... So Grippa said I need to fix it. something else. So, does that make Alexander hundreds of years old too? Okay, so those pipes. Do whatever it takes. Does that mean tell me do whatever it takes? It's reminding me that I need to do something. Okay, so I got meat and tar and a crank. I'm going to make a hand cranked meat that has tar on it. else in this room. So, uh, what am I supposed to do? So f such filthy thought. Good men can safely cheer their departure as they are nothing a burden to mankind. They shall not be missed. Oh, jeez. There's clearly a machinery room over to the left. The room with the orb, which I can't do anything about. So time to do the good old take everything that you have and try using it on one specific place. I did see like half a gear though. In this room, yeah. Maybe that's a sign? I'm listening to this loud freaking bullshit over here. Clank! Clank! Meat. No. Fucking okay, tar. No. Come on, combination doesn't work. How about this and that? How about the meat? What do I have? Oh, well, I got nothing over here. I'll time to smash something into the door and see if it'll work. Let's see, what do we have here? Uh, anything? Anything a large size, maybe a hammer. These boxes. Any little secret, secret, secret thing. How about this bottle? This bottle looks like it's stirring at the break of door. Ha! It worked with the pipe! Hmm. Well, I'm confused as shit right now. To go find the letter. Oh, then you gotta find the thing and Wait, let's use the hammer. That's what we're needing. Just gonna beat the shit out of this thing. Just... God damn it. Okay, so I'm assuming the laboratory has acid that would break the thing. Um so then I can use it, but then there's the thing blocking it, so I'm assuming I need like a crowbar like object or whatever. So uh, I think I'm going to end the episode here, and then hopefully when you guys come back, uh, that I will no figure out what I'm supposed to do, uh, and so on and so forth. So uh, I hope to uh, Dave Finch you guys later.